Hey, welcome to another video from Skinny Medic. This is actually going to be a two-part quick tip video. So I'm going to give you two tips, one video, good deal. So a lot of times when you're dealing with multiple patients, it is a good idea to wear multiple sets of gloves. You've got AIDS, hepatitis, all that can be spread through bloodborne pathogens. So if you're dealing with one patient over here, and then you go to another patient, it's a good idea to wear multiple gloves. Then you can switch gloves. If I'm dealing with patient A, I have one set of gloves on. When I go over here to patient B, I can take those gloves off and come over here and have a fresh set of gloves. And if I come back, of course, then we keep swapping back and forth. So it's a good idea to have five pair of gloves on, three pair of gloves on, multiple pair of gloves, so you can um, not cross-contaminate patients. So like I was saying, it's a good idea to wear multiple sets of gloves. So the problem is if you're dealing with patient A and you go to transition to patient B, you take this pair of gloves off. You get one pair off, okay. So then I switch to here, okay. So what this part of the tip is, is to wear a different color glove. Because if you've ever worn latex gloves before, for any length of time, you know that your hand gets really sweaty. So if you wear a size medium or size large, on these gloves and your hand is really sweaty, you're not gonna be able to get the same size on. So it's a really big pain in the butt to switch gloves once this hand is really sweaty. So you know that when you get down to this black glove, say, it's time to put more gloves on. So you can just take a break, get someone else to do patient care, and you start putting more gloves on. That way you're not coming down to bare skin and then trying to put another set of gloves on. So take, rotate, then once you get down to black gloves, you know it's time to put a fresh pair of gloves on. So this stays as your base, this stays as your foundation. That way they do, your hands don't get all sweaty. Well, they are getting sweaty, but you don't have to put another pair of gloves on, on the sweaty part. So it's just a quick tip. Wear multiple sets of gloves if you have to, if you're gonna deal with multiple patients. It's just easier and it stays on cross-contamination for patients. And then have your base pair of gloves that you're maybe wearing four or five pair of gloves. Have your base pair a different color. That way you know that you're down to your base and you're not trying to put gloves over sweaty hands. It just doesn't work. So, thank you guys for watching. You never know when you'll be the first responder. Remember you need the right gear and the right training. Hey, welcome to another video from Skinny Medic. Have a quick tip video for you. This is gonna have two tips in it. So you get buy one, get one free. You don't really buy anything. So, this has two tips in it, but this is gonna be a quick tip video.